From Washington, D.C., this is the TV News.TV for Tuesday, October 18th, 2011. Brought to you by Original Productions, the powerhouse in reality television. Original Productions, a Fremantle media company. Visit them at OridgeProd.com. Hello, I'm Jeff Grimshaw, and we begin with this week's New Media, New Marketing Report. Now direct from San Francisco is Combridge's John Leland. Thanks, Jeff. Yeah, you know, in, in the today's morphing world of internet and the advertising business in general, there really are some uh, resistors out there who I want to talk to today. Uh, you know, but the big picture is that advertising dollars are still lagging in terms of moving into the online space. I saw a study recently that talked about the per user ad spend. Um, and tele traditional television and newspapers are still way out ahead on a per user basis as compared to internet advertising in general and I think Facebook advertising specifically. And that uh, you know means that Facebook is really a steal. I think YouTube advertising is really a steal on a per user basis. Um, and two articles that kind of reference this trend, one was in the New York Times talking about YouTube specifically going after the ad dollars and talking about how traditional advertising on one hand is really a, a different you know, kind of push medium, if you will, and YouTube videos uh, represent a kind of audience engagement that traditional advertising really can't touch. The other article was in Adweek talking about uh, search engine optimization and search engine advertising and how a lot of brands and advertising are still saying, we don't quite understand the analytics, we don't quite understand the return. You know, and I'm, I have to go back to you know, the old John Wanamaker quote, I know half of my advertiser, half of my advertising is working. I just don't know which half. And, you know, in, compared to traditional advertising, online advertising and social media marketing has all kinds of analytics and metrics. You know, pay-per-click advertising and Facebook advertising, you only pay when people click, which means they are engaged. Um, there's no kind of responsiveness like that in terms of traditional advertising. So I think that the new media world uh, is really way ahead of the advertising market's ability to use it. The good news is that offers deals. And I promise you over time, everybody's going to come around and represent uh, uh, sorry, everybody's going to come around and recognize that real user engagement, audience engagement is uh, a far more valuable ad buy than traditional media could ever be. And as always, we thank you, John, and we look forward to your next report available next Tuesday here at the TV News TV. The new media new marketing report is brought to you by Combridges website design, internet marketing, and social media strategies. Visit them at combridges.com. Well, all righty, big congratulations go out to AMC and The Walking Dead. That's because the season two premiere drew 7.3 million viewers, making it the most watched drama in basic cable TV history. Woohoo! And we've got a viral video update for you. Oh, sure, anyone can tell their boss to take this job and shove it, but when Joey quit, he did it with real aplomb courtesy of his own marching band that he had in tow. Check out the highlights in the latest viral video to Storm YouTube. My name's I've worked in this hotel with Providence Renaissance for three and a half years. They treat us like shit here. And I'm going to go in and quit right now with the help of my bandmates in the What Cheer Brigade.
<laughs> that is great. But now everyone's gonna quit with their own marching band. And now this. Time is growing short to register for the Turner Alumni Celebration. It happens November 12th at Hilton Atlanta. And yes, if you've got Turner in your pedigree, I'm expecting to see you there. And to register, head on over to this link and get there soon. If you want to talk to the real decision makers in the TV industry, sign on as a sponsor for the TV News. To get started, just email us at advertise at the tvnews.tv. And that about does it for this edition of the TV News. We invite you to stay close to us on Facebook, on the Twitter, on LinkedIn, and here are all of the coordinates. I'm Jeff Grimshaw. We thank you for watching, and as always, go out and make it a good day. The TV News is sponsored by Production Consultants and Equipment, PCE, Atlanta's total production facility. Visit them at pce-atlanta.com.